Hi, I'm Phil Rankin, the founder of Even Mix. I have over 10 years experience in the mixing industry. Today, I'm gonna to be covering the topics, the differences achieved by using high and low speed on your mixer. When mixing at low speed, you will gently agitate the liquid and keep it in suspension. This is an ideal method for keeping things circulated and always ready to go. Now, on the other hand, if you're dealing with a liquid that is separated and is going to need a lot of energy to remix it, you're probably gonna to wanna to use a higher speed for that initial mix. Although higher speeds will be more effective and quick, it also can cause shearing to occur and create an air vortex during the mixing process. Now, shearing is very similar to what blenders do when the blades are moving quickly and are cutting up material. A high speed mix will shear or cut material and can potentially change the chemical composition of what you're mixing. Another element to be aware of is the air vortex created when mixing at high speeds. This cyclone will help mix your product, but will also suck down a lot of unwanted air and air bubbles into your liquid. So when deciding between mixing at high or low speeds, always consider how aggressively you need to mix and how shearing and the air vortex will impact your product. Now, one key element of even mix is that we mix with our patented mixing blades at speeds that won't shear your product and are specifically designed to avoid introducing air into your liquid. You can control the mixing speed of our air motors by throttling back on the handle. Another method to control the speed is by using an air regulator to restrict the amount of airflow. Now our digital motor offers an extremely precise way of measuring speed control. We have 20 speed increments from 27 to 153 RPMs. Now with this speed control, you can easily create operating instructions for your mixing process. All in all, I hope I was able to help you understand the differences involved at mixing at high and low speeds. Thank you very much for your time.